been thinking about it for about 10 years. Uh, got serious about it about five years ago. And now it's here, Greco Street Food. Walk in and you get an instant vibe. If you've ever been to Athens, graffiti's everywhere. And he should know, Bill D'Aracino's family is from there and still lives there. So he wanted to bring the taste of his home here to East Nashville. To make it as real as possible. Um, the kind of food that we eat when we go back home is this food. You know, the first place we go to after we land is a place like Greco. The wine comes from our village uh, in Nemea. So we went there about three years ago and started talking to the, uh, the wine producers and about our concept here and what we wanted to do. And we got that process started. Even the salt on the table we got it from Greece. Uh, you know, salt's very different in Greece than it is here. All the different minerals that come into place. And now it's all here. Chicken and lamb rotating on a spit. Octopus kebabs cooking over a charcoal fire. And this place goes through a lot of octopus. We're doing about 3 or 15 whole octopus a day. It's a lot. Chef Sal runs the show. The pita is kind of like the, the centerpiece of everything without really being the centerpiece. It is so good. The pitas are made here, fresh, every morning. Somebody else make it and bring it in. It's never going to be the same. So we cook it over charcoal here with our own people, with our own hands, and it's just, you can't beat it. It's like Grandma made it. And that's what the whole team set out to achieve. And did they ever. I've had my uncles come over, and they said it was legit. So they're tough to please. So the fact that they liked it, uh, the big thumbs up. OK, we've got a beautiful rose here. What do we say? Yamas. 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 I'm going to say Yaman. That's really good. That's really good.